Something good? Mom always wanted to come back here, but she never got the chance. We settled here after her death. The island helped him forget, and he poured his heart and soul into it. This is where my heart is, too. So, if we're supposed to help someone, let's just do it. Yes. All set? Let's go. I say we check out the church first. Anyone still alive would probably go there. I would. Poor people. We can't just leave them like this. Well, what do we got here?
Somebody stop those bells! They're attracting demons from all over the city! We did it! Hey, down there! Open the gate! The guests are here! Go talk to Mother Helen. Maybe you can figure out how to silence those blasted bells. The lifeguard said you'd be coming. One of ours, possessed by a demon, locked himself in the belfry. Please help us silence these bells. They are calling to the devil's disciples. Thank you. You saved us. Those demons nearly pushed their way into the church. And Frank, his soul was lost to the beast. You need supplies, food, medicine? I'm sorry, but the city has already been looted. You won't find much unless you know where to look. I will help you, but only if you promise to help me. For it is the Lord's will that you are here. Yesterday, we lost our water supply. Two brave souls left this morning to check the pump station. They haven't returned. I can't really turn you down Can you now, find can out I? what happened to them? Or at the very least, turn the water back on? Please, when the madness started, I was able to evacuate here, but my wife and daughter, they didn't make it. Someone told me they saw them out there, half dead, half alive. 
God knows what they are, but they are no longer my family. Please, this is not easy, but I would like you to lay them to rest. To stop their suffering, yeah? They deserve peace, not this. Will you do it? Absolutely. Thank you. Here is a photo of them. Please, make it quick. We were attacked by the infected last night. I managed to get away, but I don't know what happened to my family. If they survive, they probably don't know I'm still alive. Could you help me let them know that I'm okay? I made some posters. If you can put them up around town, maybe someone I know will see them. Yeah, I'll give you a hand. Put my poster all around town and maybe they'll be able to find me. She's getting sicker and sicker. She needs her meds. She has diabetes and without insulin, she's not gonna make it. I'll give her a shot. Oh, God, thank you. There's a pharmacy not far from here, and I'm sure they have some insulin pens. I'll be right here. I don't want to leave her. Alcohol to disinfect the cuts and scrapes of the injured. So many are hurt. I can't really turn you down now, Good. can I? Hurry. Infection can be more dangerous than the original injury.
Can't hurt to look. Uh, thanks for the help. A lot of people around here need help. Talk to them. Maybe you can lend them a hand. I am making explosives. All I need is bleach. I have the means and materials to extract potassium chloride. Very volatile, very powerful. Used in grenades, motor rounds, and landmines. If you bring me bleach, I'll give you a contact grenade or a landmine. Whatever you need. Yes. Uh, good, good. Uh, excellent, wunderbar. Any kind of bleach will do. Thanks for helping me out. Excuse me! Uh, excuse me! If you're going back out there... I was with some survivors and we were attacked by looters. And I ran. And I think I'm the only one who made it. One of those bastards took my wallet. All my money, credit cards, passport, and my daughter's picture. She's back home in New York, and she's the only thing keeping me going. I'm here on business, and I promised her I'd be back in time for her 10th birthday. I've disappointed her so many times. I, 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 I just don't want to break that promise. Will you help me find those bastards? Absolutely. They jumped us by the drugstore close to the canal. They're probably still hanging around there. <laughs> My asthma inhaler is almost empty. <laughs> and I can't breathe without it. <laughs> the stress of all this is just making it worse. <laughs> I know all the nearby pharmacies have been looted, but if you happen to find even a partially full inhaler, I'd be very grateful. You can count on it. Oh, thank you. I don't know how long this one will last. <laughs> I'm Kwan. My brother and I came here from Korea to work, to send money back for our family. I went out to look for food, and those things, they tried to kill me. If not for Nick, I'd be dead. He bring me here, but my brother, he's still hiding in apartment. He probably thinks I'm dead, 
He's there all alone. It's not safe there. Could you find him and bring him back here, please? Yes. I don't have anything here to give you. But we have money. You can have it. We live at 13 Seahat Street. Thank you, and please, find my brother. We're turning this place into a fortress, and I'm in charge of defense. Before we found this place, we were searching for guns, and all we found was money. Mucho dinero! So if you can find some grain alcohol for Molotov cocktails, we would be glad to give you some of that feria. Whoever it belonged to probably isn't going to be needing it, huh? I'll give her a shot. Five bottles of alcohol. Hey! I'm trying to fix a CB radio so I can finally get someone to rescue us. But I'm missing a few parts. I need a transformer and some cable. They're in a shop not far from here. You think you could locate them for me? Yeah. Good. Just be careful. Find something. We'll turn those pendejos into fucking chimichangas. Let me know if you find it. Go get what we need. Good in here. Stay safe. Don't take any stupid chances. You don't. Well, what do we got here? Let me know if you find it. I worried about him. Hope you didn't forget about me.
Let me know if you find it. I worried about him. Do this for me, and I will pay you very well. I promise. <gasps> oh my god! You found one! Thank you! Thank you so much! Here, I have some painkillers I was saving. Please, take them! I really see the worst in people. Hopefully they're still there. Getting any younger. Anything useful? Name's Nick. My friend Bob was bitten. We did all we could to help him, but he started to turn, and we had to abandon him. With his last human impulse, he blocked the door behind us. We have to get back inside. We can't stay out here in the street. It's certain death. I'll do what I can. I'm not capable of killing the poor bugger. Bob's like a brother to me. So if it's gonna get done, it's gonna have to be you. See if you can go in through the roof and clear what's blocking the door.
me open this puppy up. In the military, they taught us how to kill. But no one ever told us what to do when your best friend is the enemy. <clears throat> Something's been bothering me. There used to be an army base here. This is where I was stationed. But ever since this insanity started, I haven't seen a bloody uniform anywhere. I'm starting to wonder if the army has something to do with this. Wouldn't be the first time a bioweapon was accidentally unleashed. Yeah. Right. Why wouldn't you be? Take this recorder and record everything you hear. There are two transmitting stations on Banoi. One's on the prison island, so you can bloody forget that one. But the other one is somewhere in the jungle. It's a long shot but you might as well give it a try. Let me know what you find out. Let's not take forever, right? Any news? Hear anything interesting? Let me know when it's over. This is great. Thank you. If you find any more alcohol, we can always use it.